Hi, this is Christina Zila from Text Broker. Today we're going to go through how an author can complete their profile to 100% complete. Let's get started. There are three ways to access your profile. This is your home page when you first log in. You can access it here over ex extended profile 100% complete. As you move through the profile, this number will change and this bar will start to fill up. You can also access it here via the ex Edit Extended Profile link next to your picture. And if you get out of your profile, you're working somewhere else in the system and you want to get back to your profile, you can do so under the Account tab and then the Public Profile submenu point. So let's take a look at your author profile. You've got quite a few options here about information that you can include for clients to find you. And we'll start with the General Information tab. There are two items on this tab that will increase your percent complete. They are your resume and your capacity. When you enter your resume, you can make it as broad or as def specified as you like. We ask that you don't include your contact information, including email addresses, Facebook pages, phone numbers, Skype addresses, and other ways for clients to contact you directly. You do not have to include the contact information for previous employers. Because this is a freelance opportunity, that level of detail isn't quite necessary. And if you really want to, y you can. But um, also consider that this is your privacy and your personal information. For your capacity, when you click on the Edit button, you'll get a little slider. You can use the mouse or the arrow keys to get to the capacity that you think you'll have per week. This is not a requirement. It's your best estimate, and you can change it at any time. The other items here are very helpful. Your nickname, you can change at any time. We ask that you do not use your full first and last name. You certainly can use a combination of full name and initial, like a full first name, a full last name, and an initial for either one of those, like, say, Jesse J. Your price in cents is the amount that you'll earn when you receive direct orders from a client. You can change this price at any time, and it will be shown to all clients who have never worked with you before. So when you can come up in a search, your price will be shown. Uh, we do add a 30% commission to the price that you set. So for a 1.5 cent price that you earn, the client will see 1.95 cents. Please keep that in mind if a client contacts you and asks for discounts on price. Next. When you fin filled out your resume and your capacity, you will be at 12% complete, so you're already making great progress. And we'll move on to the Abilities tab. Here, everything adds to your percent complete. For education and degrees, please choose your highest level of education. We do only have one, op one entry for this item. Occupation and major was pulled from the information that you included when you registered. If you happen to include a uh, freelance writer, writer, or blogger as your occupation or major, that's great. But if you have a second job or a main job, go ahead and include that as well. Our clients do look for industry experience and signifying what your other job is may help you get more direct order work. For industry experience and type of writing, both of these are drop-down selections. You can choose up to five of each, so five different industries and five different types of writing. This does not limit your access to orders in any way. It just simply is extra information that the client can search by. So if they're searching for a press release writer and you chose press release as one of your types of writing, your profile will come up. When you've added all of that information, your profile is 24% complete. Here's how it looks. And then we'll move on to writing samples. You're, you have three writing samples available to you. Every time you add a writing sample, that number decreases. Your writing samples can be as long or as short as you like. They should be representative of how you work. And we ask that you simply don't use any items that you've already been paid for via text broker, simply because the copyright to those items has been given to the client upon payment, and uh, 
we don't want clients accidentally seeing their own stuff in your profile. When you finish all three writing samples, you'll be 41% complete. You can change your writing sample at any time and you can delete it. So if you decide, oh gee, I have something better, you can swap in that new writing sample at your convenience. You'll also see here you've used all three writing samples so you don't have any left available. Next we have languages. You get additional percent complete by including your native language. We have an option for a second native language and then for foreign languages as well. So if you were raised bilingual, please do enter that information. Every time you add a language, you can add a writing sample for that language. So if you happen to be raised bilingual English and Spanish, you can add another English writing sample, then you enter in Spanish as your second native language, and you can enter a Spanish writing sample as well. This simply proves to clients that yes, you really do know the language, and this is your actual skill at writing it in that language. You can also add writing samples for foreign languages that you have learned, say, in school, or through exposure through foreign programs. When you add your language, you'll be at 47% complete. And this is kind of what your language profile looks like. Next, we have interests. Adding two interests increases your, ex your percent complete. Adding a third interest does not, but it does make you more visible to clients who are searching for that interest. When you enter your interests, please try and keep them well defined. So the example that we give you when you start to add an interest is cars or gardening. You won't want to put those in the same interest. You'll want to do one interest on cars and a second one on gardening. Your general topic will be cars. Specialized topics then would be something like NASCAR, funny cars, classic cars, or car restoration. And your description would be kind of what experience you have, why you enjoy this topic. So I'm a huge NASCAR fan and I've been to every race since I was age seven. When you've added those, like I said, you're at 59% complete. We just have a little bit more to go. The last tab here is travel. And you can when you enter 10 places that you have either been to lived or visited then we add to your percent complete um, actually the 10 is the max adding an 11th 12th or 15th doesn't help your percent complete it is information for clients so go ahead and type where you've been or where you want to add the great thing is you can add cities states national parks, countries, universities, counties, and a, a wide range of places. So even if you haven't done much travel, surely around your city there are neighboring cities and then you could add your county and your state. So there is definitely easy ways to get up to 10 items. When you have your 10 items, you'll see that your profile is 88% complete. We're almost there, just a few last minute things to do. Namely, your picture. Adding in your picture, and when we did our capacity, it didn't quite take the first time, so we had to go ahead and do it again. That got us up to 100% complete. We're all done. Unfortunately, the bar doesn't go to the end of the bar, um, I'm sorry about that. I apologize for my graphic designers and my programmers, but it does go here past the complete uh, phrase. So if you look at it that way, then you are totally 100% complete. Thank you so much for listening. I hope this has helped you complete and finalize your profile. Thank you for writing for Textbroker and good luck with your profile.